beaks and claws of birds. Birds have beaks, claws, wings and feathers. Click on the labels beak and claw to learn more about them. Beaks of birds. Birds use their beaks to carry twigs and leaves to make nests, to pick up food and break it into pieces. Click on each of these categories to learn about the different types of beaks in birds. Seed eating birds. Seed eating birds such as sparrows and pigeons have short, cone-shaped beaks. Their beaks are very strong and hard and help to crack nuts and pick seeds. Pecking birds Pecking birds such as woodpeckers have strong, sharp beaks. Their beaks help them to make holes in the trunks of trees. Nectar feeding birds. Nectar feeding birds such as hummingbirds and sunbirds have long, thin, tube-like pointed beaks. They use them to drink nectar from flowers. Flesh-eating birds. Flesh-eating birds such as vultures, owls and eagles have strong beaks that are short, thick and pointed. They are curved at the tips. It helps them cut and tear flesh. Water birds. Water birds such as ducks, swans and geese live near ponds, streams and rivers. They have flat beaks with a hole on either side. Beaks and claws of birds. Birds have beaks, claws, wings and feathers. Click on the labels beak and claw to learn more about them. Feet and claws of birds. Birds use their feet and claws to walk, perch or swim, to catch or hold food. Click on each of these categories to learn about the different types of feet and claws in birds. Perching birds Perching birds such as crows, pigeons and sparrows have three toes pointing forward and one backward. It helps them hold on to the branch of a tree tightly. Climbing birds Climbing birds such as woodpeckers have two toes pointing forward and two toes pointing backward. This helps them move forward, backward and side to side while climbing a tree. Water birds Water birds such as ducks, swans and geese have webbed feet. The front toes of these birds are joined by skin. This helps them push the water while swimming. Wading birds Wading birds such as cranes walk through water using their long legs and toes that are wide and spread out. Scratching birds. Scratching birds such as hen use their sharp and strong claws to dig the ground for food. Flesh-eating birds. Flesh-eating birds have very sharp claws called talons. These birds use talons to pick up animals such as rats for food. Nests of birds. Birds make nests to live in, lay eggs and raise baby birds. Different birds make different types of nests. Click on each of these categories.
to learn about the types of nests. Nest of tailor bird. Tailor birds sew leaves together to make their nest. They use their sharp beaks like a stitching needle. The leaves are stitched together using straw and threads. They also make the nest comfortable by filling it with wool or grass. Nest of Woodpecker The woodpecker uses its beak to peck into tree trunks and make a hole for a nest. Nest of Weaver Bird The weaver bird uses its beak to weave pieces of leaves, grass or twigs together to form a beautiful nest. The nest has an opening through which the bird enters its home. Nest of Penguin Penguins live in very cold places. Since it is difficult to find twigs, grass or straw in such places, penguins collect some stones and pebbles and make their nests. Click the correct option by identifying the image. Their feathers, how they fly, what they eat, and their nests. The body of a bird is covered with feathers. This makes it different from other animals. Let us look at the feathers of a bird. The fluffy feathers close to a bird's skin are called down feathers. They are soft and short and help to keep a bird warm. A newborn has a lot of down feathers. Present over the down feathers are the body feathers. They cover the whole body and give shape to the bird. The flight feathers are present in the wings and tail of a bird and help it to fly and change directions. The wings of a bird are attached to its body with strong muscles. These muscles help the bird to flap its wings up and down while flying. The upward movement of wings is called upstroke and the downward movement of wings is called downstroke. A bird can change directions while flying using its tail. Did you know there are some birds that cannot fly? Such birds are called flightless birds. Emu and ostrich are flightless birds. Birds eat different types of food. They eat nuts, insects, grains, seeds and fruits. The eagle and vulture eat flesh of animals. Hummingbirds suck nectar from flowers. Penguins, pelicans and kingfishers eat fish. Birds do not have teeth. So, they break and crush food using their beaks. That's a bird's nest. Birds build nests to lay eggs and stay safe from danger and bad weather. That's a tailor bird, making its nest by sewing leaves together. A weaver bird makes its nest by weaving pieces of grass, twigs and leaves together. What's that noise? That's a woodpecker pecking at the wood to make a hole for a nest. Penguins live in very cold places. So, in the absence of twigs and leaves, they use stones and pebbles to make their nest. 
These are the cup-shaped nests of most birds, such as sparrows and bulbuls. Aren't birds amazing? Go outside and look at some birds flying in the sky.